Gaza's Hamas-controlled health ministry says at least 35 women and children are among 71 people killed during Israeli airstrikes overnight. Israel has vowed to continue its attacks until Hamas releases 130 hostages it's held captive since its deadly October 7th attack. Israel's defense minister is threatening to launch a ground offensive into Gaza's southernmost town of Rafah during the holy month of Ramadan, unless those hostages are freed. The U.S. urged Israel against such a move. A major ground offensive into Rafah would result in civilian harm and displacement. Israel should not proceed with an operation that we know will create more suffering and worsen the humanitarian crisis in the absence of a viable plan to protect civilians. More than half of Gaza's 2.3 million residents have fled to Rafah. Israel has said it will evacuate them before attacking, but it's not clear where they would go.